King Charles is unlikely to have given Prince Harry a warm greeting when the Duke of Sussex rushed to be by his side, one expert has claimed. Harry flew to the UK after learning the monarch had been diagnosed with cancer. The pair enjoyed a half an hour chat, which is believed to have been their first private conversation for 15 months. While this seemed to be the first step of Harry and Charles mending their strained relationship, royal correspondent Michael Cole has revealed Harry was not afforded a traditional royal greeting by his father. It's customary for royal men to kiss on the cheek when they meet, but Michael said the king didn't do this with his son. The important thing for somebody who has just got cancer is not to contract any infections. Harry had been at 30,000 feet, breathing the same air of up to 150 other people. You can bet your life that the usual greeting of royal men, a kiss on the cheek, was not on offer, Michael told GB News. The expert did however said Harry's desire to reunite with his father seemed to be a sincere gesture. The Duke of Sussex could soon have another chance to speak with the king. Harry is set to return to the UK in May to celebrate the 10th anniversary of the Invictus Games, which he founded in 2014. Celebrations will be taking place at St. Paul's Cathedral. The news comes soon after the UK government announced a multi-million pound bid to see the Games hosted in Birmingham in 2027. Johnny Mercer, the Minister for Veterans Affairs, said, it feels like a natural rounding of the circle to come back to the UK and we're going to do everything we can to win the bid. A source close to the project claimed that a British, based Invictus Games would have the approval of both Harry and the royal family. Harry has indicated that he is comfortable coming back for a British, based Invictus Games and we understand that the Games have always had the support of the rest of the royal family, they told the Express. Snapchat Instagram Twitter Facebook YouTube Threads Thank you.